The search for a missing Mount Vernon man is over. As we mentioned last night on Fox 10 News at 9 o'clock and on Fox10TV.com, Charles Chuck Black's body was found yesterday afternoon in Centronel. He had been missing for three days. Fox News reporter Derrica Williams spoke with his family. <laughs> The discovery of Charles Chuck Black III was too much for loved ones to handle. It's hard to imagine anybody doing this to my brother. Police discovered his body Wednesday in a shallow grave off Coy Smith Highway. It was on land owned by the family of the suspect in the case, Brandon Jarrell Newburn. Police made the find after following tips about Black's suspicious disappearance from Betty Jo's lounge. On Monday, there were some items from Mr. Black's wallet that were found on the side of one of the uh, back roads in Citronelle. Police formed a search party and investigated leads. Wednesday morning, um, the chief had gone out to one of the locations just to see what he could see initially. Uh, found some traces of uh, blood and some clothing. Although Black was found about four miles away from the lounge, police believe he was killed early Sunday morning, and the evidence points back to here. The information that uh, Officer Miles has got puts the assault happening at the bar in the parking lot. Mr. Newman is being charged with robbery first and murder, so we believe it was a robbery gone bad. Police say the victim and the suspect didn't know each other, but they were both at the lounge the same night. Family members are still trying to understand how such a vicious crime could happen. He was always real kind-hearted. Chuck was one of the best guys you ever want to meet. Never hurt a soul. Loved ones want justice served. Police still have not arrested an accomplice whom they say helped bury Black. Meanwhile, the victim's wife is trying to cope with losing her husband, who was a devoted father. No, we just take it day by day and ask for God's strength. And you got to be strong for the kids. Reporting from Citronelle, Derricka Williams, Fox 10 News. The cause of death hasn't been determined yet. Investigators hope to learn more after an autopsy.